So we're out on the beautiful Bermuda waters on the Rainbow Runner boat with Greg and we're going to be trying this amazing classic experience of helmet diving. Greg, can you tell us a little bit more about it? Sure. Well, um, my father came here from Brooklyn, New York in mm -hmm. 1930. He was expecting to see all sorts of exotic animals he didn't see until he went underwater. Mm -hmm. He built his first diving helmet that year at age 10. Uh, perfected it all during his youth and then after the war in 47 started taking passengers like just these folks here um, on a walk on the bottom of the floor. Wonderful, thank you so much. Let's go. They've been doing this since the 40s and 50s. It's I guess a very classic thing to do but you know at the same time it becomes very modern because you know they're still doing it and it's still a wonderful experience so you know it's got to be good if it's been around all this time. It's not that cold. <laughs> The Hartley family has been renowned for its taming training of fish in their natural environment. So today we're going to see Herb the Hind and um, another snapper that we haven't named yet. And we also have Diana the Angel Fish. We have had other creatures. E.T. might show up. We'll just have to take whoever's down there and have a good time with it. That was absolutely wonderful. I can't tell you. I mean, you can snorkel, you can dive, but you never get that close to the fish. And I actually touched them, a puffer fish about this big, and the snapper, and the, the hinds. It was just it was so exciting and thrilling just to see everything so close. It's got to be one of the most magical experiences I've had. That was, oh, fantastic.